Hi there, I'm Charles Maxson, a developer advocate for Google Workspace. In this video, I'll walk you through setting up GitHub for Google Chat and cover some of its key features to help you start using it like a pro. Before you begin, here are some of the things you'll need to get started. You'll need permission from your Google Workspace administrator to install chat apps. You'll also need access to the GitHub account you'll be connecting with. In this quick video, you'll learn how to install the GitHub for Google Chat app, how to authorize and set up the app to use it, you'll learn how to use some of its key features, and then finally, how to use its help feature to learn even more about what the app can do. So let's get started. Once the GitHub for Google Chat app has been allowed by your administrator, simply enter at GitHub to add the app to a space in Google Chat, and this will kick off the setup flow. The first step is to authorize Google Chat to access your GitHub account. Select the Authorize button. Choose a repository you want to connect with. You can also choose any or all of the notification types you'd like to receive, or just opt for all of them, as we will in this case, and click Save. And that's all there is to setting it up. Now let's see how notifications are automatically sent from GitHub to Google Chat. I'll create a new issue in GitHub. I'll give it a title and a description, and then I'll submit it. And then I'll flip back over to Google Chat, where I can already see the new issues notification has been sent to the chat space, where I can see the title and the description. And I can even click view to get more details back over in GitHub if I wanted to. GitHub for chat supports link previews. Let's see how these work. I'll paste in a link to the new GitHub issue in Google Chat and share that with the team. What's neat here is with no additional steps required by me, chat responds with the details of that issue from GitHub so everyone on the team has more information about it instantly. And again, right from within the preview, anyone can click view and open it directly in GitHub to take further action immediately. Let's now create a GitHub issue right from within Google Chat. Type slash GitHub issue in the chat space to kick off the flow where you will use a dialog to create the new issue. First, we'll select the repository for the issue. We'll give it a title and a very descriptive comment, and then select Create. Now, you will see that our issue number six has been created with the details we provided. Finally, here's how you can use the help command to explore more of what the GitHub app can do. Type slash GitHub help, and you'll get a list of all the apps available slash commands as well as several buttons you can use for quick actions with the app. That wraps up this short how-to video for setting up and using GitHub for Google Chat. Stay tuned for other how-to videos of your other favorite tools that integrate with Google Workspace.